Laurent Rousseau is going to be a rather interesting artist. He's really not going to get into art until much later in life. In fact, he doesn't really start showing until after his retirement. And he will be almost universally derided. Uh, so consequently, he will show in the Salon de Independence. And he does so almost every year until his death. Despite that, critics will constantly harp on him for his very basic settings. There's a lack of depth. He's got doll-like figures. He's got uh, almost cardboard cutout forms in his imagery. And yet he will be very inspirational in the 20th century. The piece we're looking at is his Sleeping Gypsy. Now in it, what we have is this form of the gypsy in a very colorful robe sleeping in a desert landscape before or be, uh, beside her a musical instrument in her hand some kind of stick and behind her what appears to be a menacing stuffed animal or a particularly vicious stuffed lion either way it doesn't quite look realistic but what Rousseau is doing is something very different He's capturing the unconscious. He's capturing this very uncomfortable element where you could have a dream that isn't quite nightmare, but isn't really positive either. And we've all had them. It could be uh, a dream where you're, say, falling. It's not a bad fall, but it's enough to wake you up and startle you. Or a dream where you keep opening doors and ending up in weird places. Or a dream where you're not quite awake. Or whatever the situation is. And he's really capturing that unconsciousness here in a very simple form. The beauty of Rousseau is his composition and his design more so than his ability to create three-dimensional space because obviously that's not really his goal here. That's not really what he's trying to do. But it becomes incredibly inspirational. This idea of capturing the unconscious will speak to the Freudian sensibilities of the late 19th century where everything about dreams is very popular. But will also inspire and directly impact the 20th century when we get into surrealism where artists will try and capture the unconscious and make it tangible taking those romantic notions of the 19th century and expanding on them just like Rousseau does here in Sleeping Gypsy.